preoperative evaluation of a patient of bed sore is critical to successful outcomes of our bed sore reconstruction of those factors which we need to evaluate preoperatively presence or absence of spasticity is a must to do evaluation so why bed sores must not be operated in presence of spasticity by operated i mean reconstructive procedure should not be done debridement obviously as and when necessary should be considered but what happens in presence of spasticity is that because of the involuntary muscle contractions because of the spasms it places excessive stress on the suture line and there is almost always reopening of the suture line reopening of the wound even if we have put in a graft or a flap a muscle flap or a fascia cutis flap spasticity always always and always results in opening up of the suture line this is one important part as to why pressure sores must not be operated in presence of spasticity second important part is the difficulty in post operative care and post operative positioning because of the spasticity it becomes very difficult for us to position the patient in the desired position so if we have operated a sacral pressure sore it becomes difficult depending upon the spasticity of the muscle groups involved to position the patient appropriately that is why spasticity must always be taken care of we should treat spasticity by variety of modalities available to us and once spasticity is under control then we can go ahead and consider reconstruction of that particular bed sore